Hi you guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see from the title of today's video and the intro, we are at Hobby Lobby and we are looking at all they have set up for the Christmas season. They do not have a lot out, but they have a considerable amount and you can go in there if you don't want to miss anything you can grab a couple of things um if you want to get some ideas for um maybe some themes that you're doing this year um, it's all already 40 percent off as well you guys so um i'm not going to be doing a whole lot of talking i'm just going to try to um, show you the prices as well as a lot of variety of items and i'll come back and talk to you guys later i hope you enjoy all of the music and all of the great holiday finds So you guys, um, I didn't get a close up of the price. Um, I'm sorry about that, but they were about um, 120 bucks for, um, I think they are six foot of garland. Um, and still at 40% off, you're still gonna be paying just a little bit over 70 bucks. In my opinion, that's still a lot of money, but <laughs> um, just want to let you know the prices so you can make a determination. You all know how much I love a good DIY. This is definitely the section for me. Um, I did pick up a wreath, um, just a plain one, as you can see, this evergreen. And um, I wasn't sure exactly what I was going to do with it. After a little bit more thought, um, I decided to get the plain garland versus um, the plain wreath because of the DIY that I had in mind. But um, at 40% off, you guys, these were definitely affordable. They're around 20 to um, about 10 bucks. So this is definitely something that I would DIY and I suggest you do it too if you want something very specific and themed for your holiday decor. So if you're wondering, Troy, why are you in the boxes? because I wanted to see what was in there. <laughs> it wasn't on the shelf yet. Yes, I was a little bit extra. They had a couple of um, arrangements, as you can see here. This is a memory foam uh, Christmas pad, and um, they were about, not too expensive, around a little bit over $25. So um, really reasonable with the 40% off. So you guys, I was fiddling around with this um, rug that you would put outdoors. Uh, to tell you the truth, I have purchased a, a Christmas outdoor um, rug already and I wanted to put this one under it, but I wasn't sure that it was going to fit. But after I looked at the uh, dimensions on the back, I was absolutely sure that um, the outdoor um, rug that I had uh, purchased would definitely be way too big and this was not um, large enough to make the um, impression that I wanted it to.
So here we are on the ribbon aisle. Um, the ribbon on average, it's about $10 and at 40% um, off, you know, that's four bucks. So they're about $7 and they are considerable length. Um, I feel that you can take one ribbon and decorate a Christmas tree if it's about um, a six foot size, nothing much bigger than that. But I had a couple other DIYs in mind. That's why I grabbed up two. But um, you guys, this is the section that runs out of variety very quickly. If you are going to DIY this year, if you want ribbon on your tree, I do suggest you get into Hobby Lobby right now. So I'm just going to give you guys a quick peek down the ornament aisle. 
um, it's just you know the regular old shatterproof bulbs and I'm um, color coordinated um, different you know themes the blue and the white as you can see the gold and red I thought there wasn't really a need to go down that aisle <laughs> um, you know what color theme you do or you don't want nothing too special about bulbs so I decided to come down here with the pics um, where I could look at different things that I would like to make for floral arrangements or for swags or wreath or um, even centerpieces for you know a holiday table or something like that. So you guys, um, here with the greenery, I absolutely love. I love things that are like flocked, but you know, not overwhelmingly so. Um, I love these uh, pine picks. They uh, give such a realistic look to um, the normal wreaths and the normal uh, garlands that aren't, you know, too high in. And I like mixing and matching different greens, you know, for that um, winter wonderland country feel. So you guys, um, I couldn't decide between the um, Christmas tree that you see here and uh, the snowman that you're about to see as a countdown to the holidays. My um, son, my middle son, absolutely loves doing countdowns. He's so meticulous and very organized with his time and expectations. So I had to grab one and I thought that the Christmas tree would look really cool on his dresser.
Whose lights fill the city There are people everywhere The snow is falling white and pretty As I stroll on my way to you How will you feel about packing up today? So you guys, um, here are the Christmas trees that Hobby Lobby has out right now. In my opinion, they are extremely steep even considering the 40% uh, off sale these definitely aren't in my budget but they're absolutely gorgeous and they may give you an idea of some things that you may want and you might have to check out you know a place like big lots or walmart for more affordable trees now this is absolutely stunning i think this tree is uh, 12 feet and um yeah i had to back up of my camera angle just a little bit to give you you know a view of it it's majestic that's the only word i can think of <laughs> but um that is more than i paid for a, a car note so there's no way i'm going to spend that on a christmas tree but it sure is pretty What I love about um, Hobby Lobby putting together the color coordinated um, items to decorate the tree as far as picks and the ornaments as well is that um, everyone doesn't have um, an eye for what they want. They, you know, maybe have some ideas and things in that nature, but I feel like these aisles put it together for you. They let you know um, what colors would go together, the different types of ornaments that you could use and the different type of picks that you could interchange. So I really love this aisle. Um, I definitely won't be doing anything glam this year, but it is stunning to look at. Christmas, all the happy smiles and the wishes, and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. Tell me one thing is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. So you guys, we are nearing the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed seeing the early decor that Hobby Lobby has out and hopefully you were able to get some ideas, some inspiration, and maybe some realistic expectations about that holiday budget. I hope to see y'all in the next one. Bye.